friends, happy, happy Easter. Today we're celebrating the resurrection of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. We have talked a little bit about how in the Old Testament, in the tabernacle, the priests would offer an animal as a sacrifice for people's sins. God offered his people forgiveness in exchange for their sacrifice. This was how it had been done for thousands of years. God had a new plan for salvation though. He had a special way for us to apologize for our sins and have a closer relationship to him. So great was God's love for us that he sent a part of himself, his son, to us. Jesus performed miracles, witnessed of his own coming, and promised people that he would make a bridge to God. Jesus is that bridge. Jesus links us to God. Jesus is God. So, Instead of the people taking a lamb or goat or cow or any other animal of sacrifice to God, Jesus became the sacrifice. The people who praised him on Palm Sunday turned against him. That makes me sad. It hurts our hearts when friends we have suddenly do something not nice or decide not to play with us anymore. I'm sure this made Jesus very sad, but he knew this was for everyone. Each one of you, though he had not even been born yet, were on Jesus' mind when he made his sacrifice. He was nailed to a cross and died. Today, though, today is about the day Jesus came back to life. He rose from the dead three days after his death. Death cannot hold God. Death is defeated, just like Goliath was defeated by David, just like the Egyptians were defeated through Moses by God. Jesus' body was put into a cave and a big stone, too heavy for a man to move, was rolled in front of the entrance. When a group of women who were friends of Jesus went to visit his grave, they found the stone rolled away and the grave empty. An angel waited to tell them that Jesus was alive. Now all we need to do is tell Jesus we are sorry for the wrong things we have done. We have to do our very best not to do the same wrong things again and be careful for our choices. Jesus has promised to forgive us and make us clean of sin. Thank you, Jesus, for your sacrifice. Thank you for being both our savior and our friend. Help us to make good choices. Help us to listen to the Holy Spirit when he tells us not to do something or to change what we are doing. We love you so much, amen. Happy Easter, friends. Remember, I love you and God loves you too. Bye, guys.